Hello everyone, welcome back to Pamela's Cooking and Blog. If you are new here, you are welcome and thank you for watching this video today. You can also check out my playlist. You have wonderful and nice and simple recipes from this channel. Today, as you can see, I have here chicken. We are going to fry crispy, delicious, seasoned chicken and to do this i already have here my chicken i've already cleaned it and i have in here ginger garlic and onion i have here my thyme i have rosemary i have gloves i also have here vegetable and chicken seasoned both and i'm going to use a little of paprika powder and i also have here basilicum or basil leaves dried one and of course my salt so let's start by blending my onion and i'll add some water this and I'll go ahead and add my thyme I'll also add my basil leaf or the dry basil rosemary Also go ahead and take some of my gloves I'm going to use this here this much it should be enough and so I'm going to blend this and then we continue and here is my blended natural spices I have a little of water in here so I'll just add it in I'll still need more water, so I'm rinsing my blender and then add it to it. And I'm going ahead to add all the seasons. This is my vegetable season. Just add enough. And this is my chicken season. It's also in. Go ahead and add my paprika smoked paprika powder in just to make it spicy and salt of course and I'm going to mix this just like this and in there I'm going to drop my chicken it's already clean I'm going to give it a good mix This is it here so I'm going to cook this like 25 minutes to 30 minutes and then we will continue guys this is my chicken on fire so I'm just going to cover it and allow it to cook and then we will continue And here is my chicken, well cooked. So I'm going to remove it from the water. And the most important thing here is I don't throw the water away. I keep it, you can use it for jollof rice. You can use it to cook your rice. If you are making fried rice, you can use it in cooking. So I'll just get myself 
glass container and then I will keep it in the aroma of this chicken is so nice oh, oh, oh. and this is it here guys let's look at this so we are going to fry it and before I fry my chicken, this is how I store my stock, which I can use later for jollof rice or even rice that I will be using to cook. This is it. So I will allow it to cool down and then you just cover it, keep it in your fridge and you can use it later. And guys, I'm going to fry my chicken now. lovely people this is the end result you can see my crispy fried chicken and I hope you can also do it so thank you so much for keeping up with me see you again with another simple and easy recipe from me bye bye and God bless you